guys welcome back to the channel um, today is a very very happy day because we're back on bring me the horizon the song is follow you live at the royal albert hall now i'm very very happy about this because i thought i'd completed the set i thought i'd done the whole um albert hall set list and it's only yesterday when somebody said oh you, uh, you need to do follow you on uh, bring me the horizon i was like well okay then you know because i'm not done for ages so I'll, I'll put it on and then when I clicked on it, it showed me there's an Albert Hall, and I was like, yes, because everyone knows if they've been watching this channel from the beginning, that the Bring Me The Horizon Albert Halls are one of my very favorite videos to watch on reactions. So, you know, I'm really, really happy to be doing one that, still not, that I haven't heard. Uh, and I can't wait, because Albert Hall is a very special place for artists. Uh, from, well, from the artists that I've checked out anyway. Uh, anyway, before I start this reaction, uh, if you do like my videos, please consider liking and subscribing. It helps me, helps the channel, etc. I bring you more content and I appreciate it. So without further ado, bring the horizon, follow you live at the Albert Hall. Let's go. This feels like a conversation. This time, maybe his partner or something. Where he's saying, um, "Is is as you say, his thoughts are haunting him, and um, and and my heart feels like he's a ghost." Did he say, like it's not there, but he wants to stay by his side. Don't leave him alone. So maybe he still needs the help and support of this person. That's what it sounds like uh, so far. Because I know Ollie does struggle a lot with mental health. Um, from what I've checked out so far. And he writes a lot of his songs about his um, experiences. Very low key this one. Show me what I can't see when the spark in my eyes is gone. You got me on my knees, I'm your one that come. Cross my heart and hope to die. Promise you I'll never leave your side. So this is this is a bit like a love story. Um, he's, the conversation he's gone back to her after that first part of pause is saying that he will never leave her side no matter what happens. And now he's talking about extremities, that if she did something, uh, if she went this way, he'd go with her. If you throw me to the flames, I think he said, he, w he would follow her because it's like, like that's the love and the support that he wants from this person. That's what it sounds like to me. I will check the song facts out at the end. I really loved the way that kicked in. I thought it was all going to be low key, the way it was going. Um, but then obviously, you know, it's bringing me the horizon. So <laughs> let's go. Make some fucking noise. <laughs> I forgot about his accent. Make some fucking noise. <laughs> Sorry. Make some fucking noise. <laughs> Come sink into me and let me breathe you in. I'll be gravity, you be my oxygen. So dig to grace, cause when you die, I swear I'll be leaving by your side.
is an appreciation song to his partner or his wife or whoever at the time. I can't remember when they they, they, they recorded this because he said, um, "Yeah, under, I'm under your spell," so which means he'll do anything to please this person. Uh, this, is, this is an absolutely beautiful song, and again another great performance from the Albert Hall. I'm gonna have to have a look for the set list again to make sure that I've done every single song because <laughs> I'm sure someone told me last time that you, you've completed the set, so I didn't bother looking. But obviously, I'm not seeing this one, so let's go. <laughs> So fucking nice. <laughs> there is something about the Albert Hall that makes ordinary songs sound magical because like I say some of the other songs that I checked out from Bring the Horizon that I did before the Albert Hall they just sounded next level in the Albert Hall and I bet that's exactly the same I bet that sounds a lot better in the Albert Hall than it's on the recording um, so I'll definitely have to check that out um, absolutely loved it I thought it was a beautiful song and I think he was paying homage to his other well, his significant other half I will look at the song meanings now to see exactly if I was right but I think that's pretty much self-explanatory <laughs> for once I have absolutely nailed a um, description Ollie Sykes lyrics are a tribute to his wife Hannah Sykes he's explained it comes from when me and my other half were going through a rough patch where things didn't look too good it was a real eye opener for me because I realised that no matter how bad being together can sometimes get the alternative is so much worse it is one of those beautiful realisations that only that can only come from something that's really ugly but yeah like I say a tribute to his wife I didn't know his wife's called Hannah so yeah tribute to Hannah who's uh, obviously his wife and you know I like it when I get the sound packs because it means my radar's on point when I don't get it I, <laughs> I feel stupid sometimes but yeah really enjoyed that that was an absolutely brilliant song um, and another one um, that I can chalk off from that Albert Hall I will have to, I will definitely definitely have to go through the set list again to make sure I have done all the songs because <laughs> well, it, no, it was a nice little find that I'm quite happy um, anyway if you like my videos please like subscribe and support me on patreon discord or twitter and the links are in the description thanks for watching us to see you on the next one